This is our hotel room at the West End Washington Hilton. It's a huge bed, huge TV, and then a little blind that goes nowhere. Got a little tea bar, another two TVs, two TVs, two TVs. and then a little work workstation oh, no. for yeah. Robert. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Say hi. Oh, hello. So, while Robert is working a full day, I may just find some things to do in the area, walk around a little bit. It seems like the weather, at least last night, was really bad because there was a lot of broken trees and and things just scattered around the parks here. So I'm glad that we missed that before we came. I'm looking right now on Yelp and trying to see if I can find maybe like some, nothing really to eat, but like a little store, or, you know, some attractions in the area to kill some time. They also have a, a Cuban rum bar. Um, at the hotel, which looks like fun, so maybe we'll go there later. Things to do. You could. Oh, the Exorcist steps, babe. Huh? The location of the steps from the Exorcist is walking distance from here. <laughs> Three building. So that's the library. That's the library. The oh, okay. library too. <laughs> Try not to. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> So we can stop right here, and we'll just look at a map. <laughs> Give you guys a little bit of an orient. at the hotel finally it was 15 minutes or so walk um, there and then also 15 minutes back so I'm pretty tired I'm gonna wear tennis shoes here but I'll show you what I got from immigrant um, immigrant food so I'll turn the camera around these are the madam VP uh, let me see VP bowls I guess it has like curry chicken, pineapple, um, spinach, turmeric rice, etc. So it looks super good. Also got these sliders. These are the Taj Mahal sliders. I think these are also, you know, spiced and has coleslaw, things like that. So I'm excited to eat. <sighs> I'm burning up. So you can train yourself to do that at every waking moment. Then this is the only dinner restaurant that I booked. I want it. 
Patriotic. I feel like you feel like a, a American patriot. Like an American badass. I feel like Patrick Revere himself. Patrick Parker. Patrick. Uh, Parker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not very patriotic. Patrick Revere. Is that the Museum of African American history? Yes. So all the museums here were booked because we bought our tickets to DC two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. So, not a lot of planning. What's uh, what holidays coming up? The Fourth of July. Where better to spend it than the nation's capital? It's also where people are gathering. So it might be. Yeah, where you set up. I mean, every time I walk down the street, I could say this might be dangerous. <laughs> it's not how I choose to live my life. <laughs> Dangerous everywhere. Yeah. What do you think about the International Spy Museum? It was very small, but it was cool. Lots of interesting details of this very detail-oriented career. It's, it's too detailed. Too many things. But I wish I had one of those microscope, micros, microscope pens so I could read messages and dots. There's so many ways to kill people. Right? Did you see the... The anthrax? The ricin? Yeah. That was yeah. cool. Yeah, yeah. That was Leo Trotsky, right? Is, was he the one that died of... Oh, uh, yeah. Got him in the leg, though. Oh, yeah, with the umbrella. And then they tested it on a pig, and they were like, yup, that's what it was. <laughs> Killed him. Killed him like a pig. It's a wonder that none of us... That all of us are alive. <laughs> it is a wonder. It's a How wonder. are we all still alive? <laughs>